Today we are diving into 6 chess checkmate patterns which can turn you into chess tactical beast. Each one is classic, tested over centuries and used by the best to bring games to sharp end. Let's dive in and uncover how these work and how can you use them. The first one is Anastasia's mate, We are knight and rook are teamed up to deliver checkmate to their opponent's king on the each. Knight is controlling escape squares and rook delivers checkmate from another side. This kind of positions usually appear when opponent's king is trapped by their own pieces or the, when their kings are on the edge. Anderson's mate is a checkmate pattern which features a rook supported by a pawn as it checkmates opposing king along the 8th rank from the corner. The pawn is protected by king or another piece. The checkmate pattern was named by Adolf Andersen, a German chess player from the 19th century. This one is Arabian checkmate, a classic checkmate from the origins of chess. Here, rook and knight join forces to trap a king from the corner, while knight is covering all key escaping squares. Rook is delivering checkmate. If you want to learn well how to coordinate chess pieces, this kind of checkmate patterns are for you. The fourth one is the most common one called the bank rank checkmate. This kind of checkmate happens when the opponent's king is trapped behind by its own pawn shield and checkmate is delivered by either rook or queen. The fifth one is baluster mate, a checkmate combination which demonstrates optimal combination between queen and bishop. Checkmate on c6. The last sixth checkmate of this episode is the Blackburn's checkmate, which involves two bishops and knight against a castled king. Bishop h7 checkmate. And if you liked the video, make sure to give thumbs up and subscribe for more.